Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, I'm Sam and Mum with your boys. And today we're going to get, try and get a pink hair dye out of two dressing gowns and my pillowcase. This is my pillowcase. Um, it's actually more pink than it's showing up on camera. And in my dressing gown, we've got the grey one which has got it in the hood. So this is one of them. I'm actually going to throw this in, this will have been put in this morning. Um, and we can see if it comes out or not. Obviously, I've put this in, in with Ace Whites before, but I've never had pink hair dye on it. And then I have this one. Now, I don't think this is going to show up on camera, but there's like a pink tinge, maybe slightly, over the hood. But it's also absolutely filthy. So we are going to put Ace Whites to the test and see how we can get, see if we can get the hair dye out. Just quickly though, this first portion of the video is sponsored by Skillshare. They are an amazing online resource that has thousands and thousands of classes to get those creative juices flowing. Now, I've done a few classes now and the one I've been doing at the moment, um, and they are really handy because they are only about 60 minutes long-ish and some of them are way shorter than that as well. So perfect for fitting in in those evenings or whatever else and just being able to learn a new skill. I've just done a video on learning Premiere Pro and editing a how-to video. I have desperately wanted to learn how to use Premiere Pro so I can update and like edit my videos a loads better. So these classes are absolutely amazing. Just have a go, go and have a look. They have so much there to do and to learn and to and just to make this time worthwhile that we are stuck inside not doing much. Um, so let's jump straight into the video. So first of all, I am going to clean my jaw. Um, I've had this washing machine a whole month and I've not cleaned it and I don't know how to get it out. Um, I really should look at the manual, shouldn't I? I don't know how to get this out. Ah! So this is completely different to mine and it just slides out. So this is just my new hot point washing machine. I've had this about two months. So I'm gonna give this a scrub just with fairy liquid, get it all clean and ready to go for the next stage. So what I'm gonna do first is, oh look, you can really see how this is. Um, I'm gonna have a pre-soak with this, I think. And I've just filled my sink with some red hot water out of the tap. Um, this is the bottle that I use, this is Ace White. I do use the colour versions of this for colours. It's really good with school uniforms, obviously. At the moment, we're not needing that, but this is great for white. Um, so I put it on a white wash on a 90 degree because the heat helps as well. So you can use this in for general cleaning. Now it says, for hand wash, you need 100 mils for 10 litres. 150 mils for 10 litres and um, soak for 20 minutes. Also, when you're putting it in the washing machine, you need to make sure that you're putting the right amount in. So for the washing machine is, so you put this in the washing machine and it's a one and a half cups, which is around 250 mils. So make sure you are putting enough of it is my suggestion. Now, I'm just gonna add a bit at a time because if I'm not measuring it out, I am being, and I'm just gonna soak this in. It's ruined anyway, so we may as well try and see if we can get it out. I'm just gonna put it in here, give it all a swirl round. I'm hoping it kind of doesn't pull the color out of my, wow! Look at that, it's coming out already. There's some more darker patches, but it's definitely lifting already. That is amazing. So, while I get, I'm just going to leave that soak. It probably doesn't need the whole amount of time because um, I'm going to put it in the wash as well. You can see there how grubby that is looking compared to how white this is. Um, pull the back of the hood um, in comparison to the front where it's dirty. So, can we see the difference? This front of my dressing gown is really, really grubby. Let's get this in the wash. I sometimes throw white socks in here or anything that I'm gonna do a white wash that I normally just chuck in the washing machine but needs now needs a bleach. So we're gonna put that in there. We're gonna put, I'm actually gonna wring this out because it's near enough all come out of my pillowcase. So this is the front of the pillowcase. 
it's near enough all gone already in literally a couple of minutes. So I'm going to put that in there. I'm going to set my drawer back up. Da -da -da. And there's a little blue bit. So I've given it a nice scrub. It's all clean and stuff now. Now then, this just slid off. So I'm hoping it just slides back on. <laughs> I'm hoping. <laughs> how does, how, how? Ah, there we go. It's in and it's clipped in now. That's ready to go. I am a powder lover. This is Aldi's non fire washing powder in my washing slot. The Ace Whites, I used to measure, but now in the pre wash. So it kind of goes straight into the drum before, obviously, you're washing your products. And then I put a little bit of conditioner in here. I'll shut my drawer. <laughs> Listen, it makes a little, little noise. I'm going to put it on white. I'm going to make sure my temperature, you can do it on a 60, but I'd get a better wash on a 90. Because it's got the hair dye in it, I'm going to put it on the 90 wash. Um, I'm going to set it off, let it go, and we shall come back and see it in a moment. So we're back. My washing, machine is, my washing machine is finished. It's done its 10 minute spin. Yes, I do own another dressing gown. I think I have an obsession. <laughs> Um, this one has got for Christmas. So let's put out the washing machine. I haven't even taken it out yet. So I want to get the I want to get the pillowcase before Ooh. I look at the dressing gown. Ooh. Get down, young man, before you fall off there, please. I'm just climbing in the background. Oh, Ooh. it's gone. That's like so me. Like completely gone. I was expecting some of those darker spots to still be there. <coughs> Yeah, there is not one spot of pink on there. One down, two more to go. The grey dressing gown that went in the washing machine on its own this after, well, it went in this morning. All, excuse the hole. Um, what are we doing here? It's all tangled. This is the hood no pink dye i am absolutely shocked i thought it would like kind of lighten it maybe and make it less obvious but i did not expect it to completely be gone right let's have a look at so <clears throat> hood all the tin all the like tinge of pink has gone in there but we tested this bit right at the back of the hood now this dressing gown is like a year and a half old and I do clean in it and it, it does get dirty so I'm, 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 I'm pretty shocked. The front looks really clean. Oh, let's look at the cuffs. Oh. So yeah, I do kind of wash it in I've done the whites before on my dressing gowns, the bleach whites, the ace whites before. So I do know they work, but I don't think I'd waited this long because, um, to wash the one where it got that dirty on the front. So the sniff test, I can't smell any bleach at all. I can just smell our conditioner. It feels really, really, really soft. So for me, that is a win. I cannot believe the, the, the dye came out of the pillowcase. Um, that was the worst one of all of them, so I'm absolutely shocked and get yourself some ace whites if you dye your hair. Um, obviously I don't know what it's like on permanent dye and stuff, this was the crazy colour pink Isimo, I think that's what it's called, that I used, um, so yeah, well shoved. So thank you for watching, I shall see you all in my next video, goodbye!